Soup has been underrated for too long. So I'm gonna go ahead and declare soup the new juice. But mine is going to be a twist on the classic because it's gonna be two soups in one. I love making soup at home because it's a really great way for me to clean out my fridge. A half an onion here, a little piece of broccoli. Just gotta layer in all of those flavors. Garlic, yes. Onions, yes. Leek, a little softer, sweeter version of those garlic and onion flavors all come together in the alchemy of soup world to uh, make something super delicious. Super delicious. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> now those are just the basics. Now I'm gonna make some soup. Into one pot, a little olive oil, and some butter for the other. Onions for both. and potatoes for both. Some of the flavors are going to be the same between the soups because they're both going into the same bowl. Now here's where I start to switch it up. This one gets garlic. And this one gets leek. My garlic friend is a Caribbean squash soup. So it's gonna be all about the spices for that one. So my little leaky buddy over here is my broccoli soup. So now's the time to add that in. Now I need to let these sweat for a bit and get nice and soft. For my squash soup, it's all about the spices. Starting with curry powder. And cinnamon, kind of sweet, smooth flavor that really pops with a bit of heat. A little nutmeg. And to me, this is what really kind of kicks it into Caribbean territory, and it smells like Christmas to me. I roasted this with some olive oil, some salt and pepper. Oh, look how gorgeous that is, that caramelization and just pumps up the sweet flavor of the squash. So broccoli kind of gets a bad rap. I'm not quite sure why. It's one of my favorite veg, and it's so healthy. What it does need is a little bit of garlic. Smooth, sweet, delicious with the broccoli. It's time to turn these babies into soup. A little bit of veggie stock. And a little bit of cream. I think I'm gonna get a bit of spinach to punch up that color. A little bit of lime to punch up the flavor. Here's where we get fancy. Little bit of crunch. Mm. Perfectly balanced between heat and sweet. Just kind of like a little mellow current from the cream that runs through all of it and the crunch of the pumpkin seeds. Delicious. Mm. When I said variety is the spice of life, I meant it, so why not eat two soups at once? Mm. 